Hello everyone, today we start an interesting journey of utilization of desolate bare land inside our college area to build a beautiful pleasing flower garden. The instruction and direction obtained from our statistic teacher, we started our project by preparing the field which has completely forgotten and neglected by college. The plot was covered with deep rooted tree, weed and filled with construction materials such as iron nails, rocks, wooden planks and plastic waste. On the 2nd of December, we began the first step. We removed the present iron nails, wooden plank and dug the deep rooted weeds. This created a clean space for our garden. We made our CVD design layout on our field of total area 360 x 210 cm. The total area was divided into 3 applications and 3 treatments. In total, 9 subplots were made. Each plots were made of 60 cm x 100 cm in size. There were 3 treatments that were applied. In the first treatment, we applied Bahami compost and the second treatment were bone meal and mustard cake. And on third treatment, no fertilizers were applied. Gazania flowers are half-hardy perennial plants that grow up to 50 cm tall and wide. They have bright yellow, resin-like composite inflorescence head. They flower all around the year and close at night and during cloudy weathers. Gazania flower prefers sunny location and are tolerant to dryness, poor soil, and salt. After planting Gazania, we water them regularly for a week, then we water them every alternate days. After fibrin days of plantation, we reapplied fertilizers on the plot that were required and different interculture operations such as weeding, irrigation, hoeing was done. Later of transplanting, we witnessed pot and gazinia plant. The pot developed in multiple color flowers, yellow, orange, purple, white, etc. The transformation of the land, despite seeming easy and simple at the first, developed a series of obstacles. Preparation of the field was the most challenging task overall. This included removal of the deep-rooted weeds and deep lawing of the field. The tree near our plot added complexity. Its roots were spreaded all over the plot, making us difficult to perform efficiently. In spite of facing all the challenges, we adapted to the situation and completed our tasks. We collected valuable data from the blood our aim of beautifying college premises is now successful as our plants have survived and are healthy and is producing four to five flower at once
sincero. 